Hello kitties, welcome. Don't be afraid of the strange and frightening sounds inside. Rain! Closer, I'm hungry. For 24 consecutive years during the Halloween season, the historic Clinton Red Mill Museum has transformed into one of the creepiest haunted attractions in the state. If you're looking for a good scare, you came to the right place. But before you get to see this, there are hours of preparation for the evening performance inside the Red Mill and surrounding Nine Acre Haunted Village. <laughs> a team of makeup and hair folks must change these humans into something else. Among the 75 or so actors that help bring this all to life, or should we say death, are the mother and daughter scare team of Susan and Carlina Yulch. My daughter started doing this as a volunteer when she was in high school to get volunteer credits and she wanted to act and they said if you can bring someone with you that would even be better. So my mom and I got dragged into it because I didn't want to do it by myself and I just sort of convinced her that she had to do it and we both fell in love with how much fun it is and this is our fourth year now coming back. I need help in here, come on! I need help with the, I need help with the body! I need help with the body! All the people involved in the haunted village are volunteers. Proceeds are key to the survival of the Red Mill. This is the museum's biggest fundraiser of the year, bringing in <laughs> around a quarter of the annual operating budget. <laughs> you like clowns? <laughs> We're a, a big attraction not only regionally, but also um, in the wider tri-state area. We get people that come from New Jersey, Pennsylvania, New York, as far away as Staten Island and Manhattan. Uh, we see about 4,000 people every year and we have many, many volunteers who help us out. I'd say about 350 or so every year help us out. The whole thing was great, going through the mill, the, all of the lights and the strobe lights, like it really freaked you out. There's one part where they are so camouflaged. I thought there was one person in the room and there were like five people in the room. It was really fun. I did not yeah. expect it to be as scary as it was. Yeah, we cried like the whole time. I love the house. Yeah, the Amazing. House, the house is good. And then as soon as, as soon as they come out with you, all the hanging bags, I know. that was the best Amazing. Part. For the Yulch duo and many of the other actors, once you get bitten by the scaring bug, it's hard to give it up. It's scary. I don't like being scared. I don't mind scaring others. <laughs> I definitely feel like I'm giving people who pay for it a good time. It, I mean, it, that's, that's what makes it worth it. But at the same time, I'm not an actor. I'm really scared to stand up in front of people a lot and act and pretend to be something I'm not. But when I have the makeup on and my hair all crazy like this, being able to go out and walk around town and actually be a zombie is just something that's really freeing. Hey. 